wasn't I being stubborn this morning? <laughs> super stubborn, super stubborn. But in in like the in like the whole scope of it, I like I see something, and that's the thing I want. I don't want B. I don't want A. When I do something, ask him. I have. If you ask Kavenge everything I do, mm. I don't have plan B. Isn't that risky? No, because plan A has to work. Uh, I don't have plan B. I get into it. I used to have plan B, C, D, E, E, and then plan A would never work. So I threw all my alarm like, this is the only You're thing I'm doing. You're distracting my plan oh, A. Oh, yeah. I'm 100% in all the way, all the time. And now I see why my, my dad is not a plan B kind of guy. Mm. He's just like, I have plan A, and this is what's gonna do. this is what's gonna happen, this is what we're gonna do. And I'm like, it works for you, I'm gonna work for me. And this is the thing. Even when plan A doesn't work, I don't change it. Mm. I go back, I try again. Now, after like four times and it's not working, I'm like, okay, let me look at plan A, see what I can change, then go try again. Oh yeah. I have plan A's that are in like the twenty <laughs> the twentieth stages plan of plan A. A. <laughs> Like it's gone through 20 revisions, but, but I'm still, still I'm still moving. There has to be a way to oh, walk. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There That's has a to good be a brain, way. brain mentality. There has to be a way. There mm. has to be a way. That's why I don't believe like um, when kids are just like, you know what? I tried it. It didn't work. No, you didn't try hard enough. You didn't want it enough. If you wanted it, you'd go. What, what would stop you if the, behind that door, if there was a billion dollars, it's yours. Mm. What's what's going to stop you? Your energy to get it. <sighs> Bro. I, I'll I, die. I'll, I'll be scratching through the doors using my teeth, everything. <laughs> but this is the thing. People won't do that for their dreams. Yeah. Or may, may, maybe it goes back to, we need this encouragement. Like for, for my story, it's, mm -hmm. it's the failures that I got into and knowing I couldn't run back to my parents' house mm -hmm. that made me feel like, so what next? Yeah. You have to get up and try again. Oh, yeah. You have no... That's you, good. Like, I did have plan B. I had to stick to A. I, oh, I, I, yeah. I had to still keep going, mm -hmm. keep going, keep going. If it doesn't work, I have to keep going. I have no plan B. I'm not running anywhere else. Yeah, mm. that's good. That's good. And you built your resilience. You built your resilience. The hard way. Yeah. yeah. And that's the only way to do it. You can't be, like, I hate it when people are like, I'm going to pray about, I'm like, so I can be tougher. This is the problem. Like, I remember, not, not to get, like, super deep and spiritual, mm -hmm. but there's a part in the Bible where Peter has a thorn in, in his flesh, in his back, mm -hmm. and he keeps asking God. He asks God three times, hey, God, can you take this out? Can mm -hmm. you take this flesh out of me? Mm -hmm. And the third time is like, God's like, no, my grace is sufficient. Mm -hmm. God told his servant, one of his most loved servants, no, bro, I'm not I'm helping not taking you. It. My grace is sufficient. And for me, that's, this is what it taught me. It was like, one, I can leave this pain here. Two, I could beg it to be removed. Maybe get it removed, maybe not get it removed. Or mm -hmm. I can build the strength or God will give me the strength to endure it. The pain. Yeah. Because this is the thing with pain. Um, they talked about um, one of my favorite animals is a wolf. Mm -hmm. You don't know that. My favorite animal is a wolf. So if you've seen like a wolf in like the Arctic areas, so wolves, most wolves sometimes actually, contrary to belief, are not very violent. Mm -hmm. um, but usually when a wolf is hurt, like the more pressure and pain you put on you put a on wolf, it, yeah. right? guess what happens? The more rage it builds, the more focus it builds. Oh. Like people have shot wolves and the wolf is bleeding, it's hurt in its leg, it's limping, mm. and then it stops. And the pain keeps increasing because they can't take out a bullet. They can't do me like yeah. medical treatment on themselves. Mm. So it's in there, it's in pain, and then all of a sudden, its focus increases. It's now focused on you. It knows that I am going to You're go gonna through this because this is the threat that's in front of me. I'm going to go through it. I'm going to destroy it. So they're initially not born like that? No. So wolves initially... They, they're they dangerous. A wolf is dangerous. Like, mm. I wouldn't walk up to a wolf and be like, mm. okay, okay. What's up? Yeah. But, like, they're not genuinely, like, absolutely violent. Mm. Like, all animals, they hunt. But mm. they're not generally absolutely violent. But when it's injured and when it's in pain, when it, gets the pain. it doesn't become wild. It becomes focused. Uh, it becomes focused. dangerous. It becomes dangerous. Right? Now, I, when I look at that story in the Bible, 
I think what God was trying to teach you, he's like, Peter, I want you to be dangerous. I want you to be dangerous. I don't want you to be weak. And I think we're weak. I think genuinely as humans, mm -hmm. like in the, in the caveman eras, dude, we were, we were killing mammoths. We were <laughs> killing mountain lions and then eating them for breakfast. Mm. But now, dude, wake up in the morning and it's raining. We go back in bed, cover <laughs> ourselves, go to sleep. What went wrong? Evolution. We evolved, we evolved in a way to where we made things convenient, mm -hmm. but we did not like allow ourselves or give ourselves the ability to, to make some things difficult. Oh, yeah. To make some things difficult. We wanted difficult. everything easy, oh, yeah. a remote control, oh, a car, AC. Oh, yeah. Everything, everything just became super easy. Mm -hmm. Everything just became super easy. So and it hits in our head that life is... Mm -hmm. Okay. Then that's like, oh... I, can, I don't have to go through that to get this. I can do things this way. Mm. And I remember, like, with me, my, like, I loved my dad because I grew up, I, have a, I grew up with a good life. Like, I don't, like, I don't lie to people about my life and make mm. things tragic. Like, most of the issues I've had in myself are usually brought on by myself or what, something I did. Okay. Like, I was raised in a good home. Mm. Both my parents are there. But one thing I remember, yo, my dad was not about the nonsense. Like, he was not. Like, he was very, like, you put in the work, that's what you're going to get. And I remember I was, at, I was at a track meet. I was at a track meet. And um, I twisted my ankle. This is a story I've never told anyone this story. 